What's going on, Niner Nation? I know school is winding down, finals are coming up, but spring sports are still going on, baseball and softball. Looking to make it to the conference tournament. Baseball headed down to Birmingham, Alabama to take on UAB, where the Niners went two and one this past weekend after getting their eight game win streak snapped, but have won 10 of the last 11. And Zach Jarrett hit three home runs in that Saturday game and batted 455 for the week. The new Sunday starter, Matt Brooks, didn't give up a single run and struck out three in five innings of work. As the Niners, like I said earlier, took two of three from UAB, but did get their win streak snapped in only two more weeks of conference play before the conference tournament down in Biloxi, Mississippi. Softball headed down to Hattiesburg to take on the Southern Miss Golden Eagles, where the Niners only took one of three from them. but. What a weekend it was for Haley Pace. It's been an outstanding season for her all season long, but she broke the single season home runs record and the runs scored record, and folks, she's not done. But the biggest story from this past weekend had to be Larry Ogunjobi, the first Niner to get drafted into the NFL. He was the first pick of the third round, 65th overall by the Cleveland Browns. So congrats to Larry, we're all very proud of him, but that's not it. Khalif Phillips, Brandon Banks, Austin Duke, all signed as undrafted free agents. Khalif is going to the Green Bay Packers, Brandon Banks to the Redskins, and Austin Duke to the Carolina Panthers, staying local. And some camp invites for Jamal Covington to the Kansas City Chiefs, and Kedrick Davis to the Detroit Lions. So now we'll take a look at the schedule for this upcoming week as softball plays at home for their final series of the year against Middle Tennessee, and it's a big one. They really need to win some of these games to make it into the conference tournament so they have a game Saturday and Sunday and then baseball taking on Rice at home second to last home series of the season as they will play Friday Saturday and Sunday so yeah a busy weekend here in Charlotte and I know some of you will be studying for finals but we hope to see you guys out there go Niners